tuned to Code Mania. Learn more, express more. Okay, this video is about how to use Apex Page Block tag in Visual Force page. The tag symbol of Apex Page Block is Apex Clone Page Block and the tag utility is apex page block used to style the detail or edit page for any visual force page to view or edit records next this slide is about the multiple application of apex page block in pf page so for this we need to copy the id of any record and we need to paste the id in this way id is equal to id so all the details of any records will be displayed into the page into the vf page for example the details page for this account now we can apply the visual force apex page block in this way first example and this is second example and this is third where inline editing can be accessed using page block multiple attribute option and this is to view the records using this collapsible option and this is another view of apex page block and this is another view and this is another view where multiple application of page block has been used the collapsible is controlled by apex page block section now the collapsibility has been removed from the apex page block and this is another view where the page blocks are being displayed in a full screen in the next slide i am going to demonstrate how to implement those examples or application of page block into visual force for this we are going to create a page and including apex form in the page apex form is used to submit the entered input in a apex page now we are going to add apex page block into the page and the apex page block title for example it's apex page apex page block example and there should be one id suppose pb1 now adding tab style as account So the result is one page block has been created. This is the page block looks like. Now going to create one apex page block section to display some input field in a section and providing section title. Now including the apex input field. For example, we are going. We are. We want to display account name as input field into the Visual Force page for this Apex page block. The result would be like they are asking for the 
standard controller which will be used in this page to access name field so we are adding standard controller for more details on standard controller see the details on this video description of this video so one input field has been created into the apex page block now we'll be adding more input field like account number account type and industry all the time we will have to use the API name of the field so four fields has been added into the visual force page this is how we can access or change the value now we are going to add one title of this page block section as account information see the page block section has been created I mean we can see the page block section with title now making the page block section collapsible, collapsible is equal to false and see what is the change see collapsibility has been removed now again we are making it collapsible so this is how we can make one page block section collapsible now we are going to view the record of one account this is how we can view the details we can access the value of any field for an record now adding one attribute mode as edit now the page will be look like the edit page of any object now changing the attribute value mode is equal to detail see the page will be displayed as detail page but seems like the fields are still as input field so we'll be changing this input field as output field as the detail page always read only so we can see that the records are in a detail page now changing the mode as main detail and we can see the changes here so this look like the view of the record as main detail now changing the mode as inline edit so that we can edit the records and we can save it using save command button so although the field is read only that is output field but still we can change the value by just changing the mode of page block to inline edit now we'll be creating another page block and another page block where 
the mode will be main detail and we should be accessing number of fields more fields now we are just creating the page block without any mode just changing the output field now adding account source now if we save the page oh it seems like we have added duplicate page block id so we need to change the id one two three okay now save it see multiple page blocks have been added into the page accessing different fields value now we are changing the tab style for different page blocks into different object this these are the this this one is custom object and that those two are standard object so see there should be different color variation this tab style are like the tab style of those objects now changing mode is equal to main detail for all three so these are covering all the examples as I mentioned before after saving the page it will be changed total change it will be look like main detail now we are setting the page block section collapsible is equal to false so the collapsibility will be false which will be more which will provide more attractive in look see this is something different look now we are going to change the page view into full screen that is possible using show header is equal to false so that the page will be displayed in full screen that means there should be no header or sidebar now we are setting one title for the account as we need one title to be displayed here so we have written this code now changing the front size to 20 px for both the cases and displaying the record in a full screen without side uh, sidebar and without header now with another example we are going to add one help link help URL for each and every page block so that it would be very easy to understand what is included into this page block so we are adding page block help title is equal to this account 
information or details so that if you click on the link and we are providing one URL for that see you can use the name of the account into the URL We are adding all the threes here. Same, you can use different link or different URL for that. Not a problem. Now we are saving the record, saving the page, and see the link has been created. Now, if we click on the link, the detail of the account will be displayed into in a new tab number of applications of event call will be discussing on next chapter summary we have learned the multiple application of page block